like chocolate. Can I have it for free? I'm an explosion. That smile's gonna be the end of me. I wanna say something, but you are all that I see. You got dynamite. That smile's gonna be the end of me. I bet you taste like chocolate. Can I have it for free? I'm an explosion. And that smile's gonna be the end of me. Hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel Pranay Tech World This is the Sony's brand new WH-1000XM4 Well besides the really long name we can refer to these as the Mark IV They look almost somewhat identical to the previous Mark III's, but Sony has made some improvements. So they actually heard the little request made by the users of the previous generation headphones and you know they have just painted it on to this generation headphones, the Mark IVs. Moving on to the exterior of these headphones, Sony has claimed that they have increased the soft cushioning by 10%, which is okay i guess i mean they were already comfortable and used to fit perfectly on my head also you can easily customize the size as per choice Ooh, I'm sorry, baby. I don't mean to be rude. the noise cancellation in these headphones is just incredible it cancels noise well in the mids and the lows like deep rumbling sounds of an airplane engine you can say but it struggles a little bit in cancelling the noise in the highs or basically high pitch sounds but definitely the noise cancellation feature has fairly improved and has become much much better than the mark 3s moving on to one of the newest features they have included in these headphones is the multi-user support this feature actually comes pretty handy when you have these paired to your laptop and your phone at the same time you're streaming audio from one device and then you get a phone call from the other so just instead of doing all the manual tasks like switching off the bluetooth of one device and then pairing it back to the other these headphones seamlessly connect to the device which you want to stream the audio from this feature is just a time saver and it's just so much of a better experience than pairing the devices manually and pairing it back again to the previous one and also they have the same noise cancellation controls as the previous mark 3s you also get the same sony app to pair the headphones like the previous ones and you also get the same eq settings when you look carefully inside the left ear cup, you can see a proximity sensor which detects when you are wearing the headphones or when they are off. And it switches on the noise cancellation and plays the music based on that. But the one thing which really matters are the mics. These headphones have microphones attached to the left ear cup and we can say they have fairly improved the call quality and the voice recognition too. They do cancel the background noise so if you have a really noisy background these mics would cancel the background noise and process a clearer voice to put it in simple words they would just amplify your voice and then just try to clear out the background noise i'll show you so hey guys this is the audio quality of the sony xm 4s and hey if you didn't know i had an unboxing video of this headphones on my channel i'll leave a link below in the description Make sure you watch that and uh, there are many features in the Sony app which I don't use much but it can come pretty handy sometimes. There's also this really cool feature where you can put your hand over the right ear cup and it will drop the music all the way down. Basically what it does, it amplifies the noise in your surroundings. So in theory, if you want to speak to someone, you just don't need to do the whole on and off thingy. You can just do that. And when you take your hand right off, the music comes right back on and the noise cancellation kicks in and you're right where you left off. And this thing acts super fast instantly when you take off your hand. Now coming to one of the most slightly gimmicky features I would say of this headphone, the speak to chat feature. What this feature actually does is that with the help of the sensors, it detects when I start speaking, it then turns the volume all the way down and also turns off the noise cancellation, amplifying the surroundings. 
Now the music is paused. Once I have stopped talking or the conversation has stopped, it will resume the music depending upon the settings you choose to resume back like after 15 seconds, 30 seconds or 60 seconds. When this feature was originally launched, it had certain issues wherein I had to play the music back again manually and then go back into the app to switch the noise cancellation back on. This sort of portrays a good example wherein software updates of the apps can improve or upgrade tech, in this case, these headphones in a very good way. Now, ascending towards the conclusion, these headphones will easily become my ideal headphones. I mean, they could have added a little bit more color options such as the phantom blue, but it's just a personal preference. On April 28, 2021, Sony had unveiled a new color for the Mark IVs and not for the Mark III's. The Mark III still consists of the two soluble colors of all black and silver. Well, keeping that aside, uh, this kind of gives new hope that Sony may introduce new colors to these headphones in the near future. Uh, the battery is the same as the Mark III's, but Sony has claimed that it can be used up to 5 hours with just 10 minutes of charge, which is pretty neat. Both use USB Type-C ports. Also, it has two dual noise sensors on both the ear cups to detect the noise of the surroundings. These are the headphones I would easily recommend you to buy. The sound quality is just incredible. There isn't much of a difference though between the Mark 3s and the Mark 4s. So I have linked both of these in the description. And thank you so much guys for watching this video. Check out this graph. Most of you haven't subscribed yet. So please do consider subscribing. And I will see you guys on the next one. Until then stay safe.